So I bought this Jackery Power Outdoors at um, Harbor Freight. I was gonna buy the one um, in Amazon, which was the uh, Explorer uh, 240. So, but this is um, 400 watts maximum output and it's uh, a bit cheaper. I think it's $50 cheaper and it's, it has more um, output wattage than the Explorer 240, <clears throat> which has only um, maximum of 200, uh, 230 or 200. Uh, so this has more power, more, more watts. So let's get this open. Actually, this is two ninety nine originally uh, at Harbor Freight, and they have uh, thirty dollars um, off. So it's it's, uh, it's now two hundred sixty. First off, we have this pouch here, which uh, I should say probably contain the, the cables. Let's open this up. Okay, and here is a couple of uh, cables. The one that uh, is uh, adapter to the outlet, power outlet. Um, that would charge the uh, the power station, and this one is the um, cable to charge off from uh, from your uh, cigarette lighter, the car. And um, inside we have uh, the documentation, power paperwork. So it's a Jackery Explorer 2, 290. Um, so there are different um, different versions of the the Jackery Explorer. There's the 240, the 300, the 500, the 1000, and this is the 290. Uh, it's close to the 300, but I don't know why there's a 290 and a 300 is only a small difference there of the wattage but uh and this is the only you can only find this at um, harbor fit i guess you don't you can find this at amazon the 290 but there is the 300 explorer 300 and amazon and this is uh what it looks like in the front and it's it's kind of a very sturdy and heavy not so heavy just just enough to carry around um and it has this button if you wanna if you wanna go and select this option here for for the um to plug in to charge using um your equipment using the um cigarette lighter it has the display it'll tell you the the power percentage and um, the input here is uh, for charging the station and as I said you could use this to power straight from the wall or you can charge this using your car battery via the cigarette port here, cigarette lighter. Then once it's charged up, then you can charge your devices using um, two USB. We have a five volt at the top and the 2.4 at uh, the bottom. I mean, the, it's all 2.4 ampere, five volt, I guess, so. 
Um, the only difference is in uh, the, the Explorer 300, they have the USB-C. There's three ports here. Um, so I, I, I don't think uh, that matters to me. Um, I could just, uh, up, um, you know, put an adapter, maybe use a USB-A to USB-C. Uh, so it's, it's, it's not really a big deal. And you also have the AC here where you can plug um, equipment devices uh, using the AC port, which is 110 volt and uh, 200 watts. And this is a pure sine wave electricity. And um, on the side here are uh, exhaust. Um, here too. Same on the other side and the bottom. We have this nice, uh, non slippery um, footings here. And basically, that's about it. So, I'm gonna charge this to the fully to get 100%, and I'm gonna give this a try by uh, plugging this to a mini fridge for our uh, camping trip in a couple of weeks so this will come in handy um, and I'm planning of actually using this during night time to keep the mini fridge or the uh, cooler fridge um, cool and uh, at a certain temperature freezing or whatever 35 degrees so I will use this to cool the fridge during the night time from 10 to 6 and then charge this in the morning with the uh, inverter um, and uh, yeah that's it thanks for watching